guys and welcome back to another episode of my time in portion hey hi the flying pigs is the best exploration community it's my goal to be part of it <laughs> God, Goodbye. Anyways, <laughs> uh, yeah, welcome back to another episode of my time in Portia. In the last episode, we had gone over to a new room with Mala, got trapped out of it. Uh, she helped come and fight, and then we took a break with doing some fishing. We actually got a chance to actually fish this time, so we got these cool things right here. Aren't they kind of cool? But uh, today, we have so much stuff to get started, so honestly, let's get started. Okay, so, we got some mail. I need to read with you guys. Look at this. Uh, i like to let you know that we decided to uh, start the upgrade of the Porsche Harbor with the help of Mr. Musa, the chairman of founder of Musa Investments. I have appointed Mint as the project manager along with A&G Construction to build this project. Our goal is to allow the port to receive larger ships. I cannot wait to see the results of this. Please talk with Mint as he will always ha he will have many orders for you. Gail, I hate that it has like another paper and then we'll take this. Let's do this. Sort this out. Okay, there we are. Um, let's actually grab up all of our stuff. Actually, we have to go do the mini game real quick, and then we'll go talk to Mint. Ooh, we're gonna get a cutscene. Ah, good day. For once, Gale finally gave me a project with decent funding. I can't believe it. <laughs> Albert and I have already drawn up plans for this port. We'd like to add a lighthouse, a warehouse area, and upgrade the wharf for starters. There's a lot of work to be done. Talk with him. He's handing out the commissions. Right, so Why don't you take the lighthouse for a start? For that, I'll need you to build a light source. Think you can handle that? Since we haven't sure. built a lighthouse in this area before, you'll need to talk with the research center on how to build that. Bruh. You literally made me come all the way over here just to fucking talk about the research center. Terrible. I'm gonna need disc! Oh my god! The first time I haven't had disc in them forever. <sighs> I'm gonna have to go fucking mining and shit to get some stuff. Can't believe it. We're not, I'm not gonna have enough disc for this. Okay. A light source for the lighthouse? This sounds complicated since it needs to pulse. I haven't really worked with lights before, so this should be fun. I'll get started right away. Can you please bring me five data disks to help with the research? Yeah. Yeah, give me a second, guys. I'm gonna do some quick mining and I'm going to hopefully get this data disk ready to rock and roll. Where the hell are you going? Oh, that should be enough. Thank you. I'll let you know when I have something. Cool, cool. There we go. Got the disc. Now we just gotta wait for the diagram. Cool. Okay, so let's head back home real quick. Uh, let's drop off all s majority of this stuff and then see if we have any presents that we can actually give away to Gale for the celebration. Uh, let's get that done out of the way. Let's give away this sword and see if we can give this one away. If not, then we'll come back and uh, do something else. Let's see. I see Gail's over here in the corner. He must be coming down from church. Oh, here he is. Hi! Okay. Gift. I cannot. I cannot give this sword up. So, I have to make another one. A lot of people will want this. We will see who the lucky person is. Dude. Dude. Wow. Holy shit. Okay. I'm sure the celebrations for the Day of the Bright Sun are a bit different in Barnarok. Here, the airship tradition has been going on for almost 40 years. I think it started when someone uh, jumped on the peach statue and started throwing cranberry candy at everyone. 
Dude, you all see how fucking excited everyone was about that goddamn sword? Dude. Let's see. Friend, friend, buddy, 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 buddy. Oh my god. Buddy, 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 buddy. Okay, got some more associates. And I still have some strangers. But boy, oh boy. Uh, that was something else right there. Uh, let's see. Apparently, Diego wants to have a play date together. Um, is there anything tomorrow? It's his birthday today! Oh my god, Diego, I must give you a present! Oh my god, give me a second! Oh my god! Oh my god, oh my god, I don't know what you would like! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! Okay, um, uh, okay, so let's take a look at all our stuff. Um, I know he likes cooking. Okay, so I went to go look up. Okay, so. Chill. Breathe. Who's up? So, I went to. A while ago, look up what, uh, where is it? This was, uh, unknown recipe book. Apparently it hasn't been updated yet. So this unknown recipe book is still just unknown. Um, so unfortunately I would, I wanted to give it to Diego, but apparently I cannot give it to Diego now because, uh, or I think it was Diego or Ak, because Ak also wants to be, uh, a chef and all that stuff, but I don't know. Um, Diego is also a chef currently. And I thought maybe, oh, maybe he, we have some unknown cool recipes that maybe he would be super into. Um, Django. Why keep calling him Diego? Terrible. Okay, so, um, let's take a look over here. I guess we'll play. Hey. We'll accept your, your invitation. Uh, invitation. Shall we hang out tomorrow? Sure, okay. We'll do that. And then let me, at Amber Island! No, I've never done that anything over there. No. Okay, craft candle. Can I make that? Let's see. I, I normally don't like to uh, try and figure out what people like. I like to like just look it up because, I don't know, it's just, it's just annoying. Because um, I don't like the idea of hurting their feelings because of a sincere gift that you thought maybe they would have liked, but then you, they don't like it because apparently you just didn't know. What the fuck is this? Gunpowder. Okay. There we are. Okay, so. Uh, let's give this to uh, Django as a birthday gift. Uh, a gift. I am surely there speechless. Are. Confirm. What a wonderful birthday gift. I will never forget this. Aww. It's so nice. That's, I think that's the first time I've, I've been actually able to give someone a present for their birthday. Which is actually kind of nice. So. Uh, that is something that he can, we can give to him today. Oh, yeah. Crap. We have to go. Oh, my God. I completely forgot that I have uh, commissions we have to go pick up. Oh, no. I hope no. I fucking hope that what's-his-face didn't grab any of the commissions. So, basically, uh, the port... Uh, the port... Bleh. The port. No! Please don't touch anything. Okay. So. Uh, oh, so many things. Okay. Whew, okay. So. Um... I think I want to take up, holy shit, that one's kind of expensive. Um, give me a second, guys. We'll accept hers for now. There are plenty, okay, so let's take a look. Okay, I don't know, I'm getting, I'm getting ahead of myself. So we have 10 concrete, uh, 10 concrete, 10 waterproof cl cloths, 10 ignis bricks, another 10 ignis bricks, and then, 10 more concrete. So I feel like concrete I should have uh, access to. The igneous brick, I want to say we just got it currently uh, because we had access to the plateau above. So there's something there. Also, uh, I completely forgot. I have a bunch of letters that we just finished reading. So I want to read them to you real quick uh, because I completely uh, started without you guys uh, as per usual. Uh, red. So just heads up, we posted and we'll continue to post commissions for the construction materials for the harbor and the commerce skills for the duration of this project. Please take a look if you have the time. And then the research center, after some help with the uh, director, we were able to improvise a light beacon. The, the, uh, the diagram is attached. Dude, like my brain just wants to speak super fast today and I cannot control myself. Anywho, let's collect this. Let's drop this off right here. 
sorts. Um, and then, uh, what was I doing? Okay, yeah. Uh, how much do I have? So we need concrete. It seems like we don't have any concrete, and we need resin. We don't have resin. The fuck. Okay. Um. That's interesting. What else is resin used for? Huh. Um. Let's actually do this. I didn't know that. Okay, cool. Okay, so we'll get this done. Uh, get this going. Okay, I did not know we didn't have any resin. Interesting. That's gonna take uh, 12 hours. Okay, fun, cool. We're just gonna have to put this somewhere. Um, I think it was in here. And then dirt's in here as well. No, this is cultivated soil. Okay, cool. Um, just gonna have to put this here then. And then we have the bricks. So we have 10, uh, almost basically twice uh, amounts. Let's look here. I think it's in here. Yes. Okay, we have... Let's craft this. So we need 10 of these twice. So we need... Yeah, we'll just do the 25 for now. Um, and then let's put this away real quick. Um, and then for this, take this up. Let's just fuel up everything real quick. And then we're going to, so yeah, so we're going to have the concrete being made. We're going to have these things over here being made. Um, let's see, do we have aluminum? Yes, we do. Okay, cool. So we have plenty then. Uh, let's see. There we are. Okay, cool. So we have that done. And then I guess we'll put up the beacon as well. So let's see. We have the diagram for the beacon. Um, let's go here. Uh, let's see. Is it on the new area? Okay, here it is. Check this out. Uh, plates, lamps, engine, strong glass. Okay, cool. So let's go here. Uh, let's go to our metal wires and stuff like that. So the glass, we have the glass. Um, I wasn't paying attention at all what I was fucking supposed to collect. Glass, so we have the second glass, the advanced engine. We need one advanced engine for the light bulb to turn. Uh, let's see, it should be in here. Uh, just the one. Grab this. And then it should be the water things over here. There we are. And then I think uh, it's the plates, but I am between. Uh, where's the engine? Here it is. Okay, cool. And then, uh, what else do we need? Steel plates. Wait, was it steel plates or was it aluminum plates? Aluminum plates. Where do I make aluminum plates again? Do I even have aluminum plates? It should be in here, right? Ah, okay, cool. So, um, let me actually, okay, let me take a quick look, quick, quick look. What do I need to make uh, one of these advanced grinders? Okay. Hmm. I think you can donate this. I think you can donate this. So let's actually do that. Let's actually take that. Uh, let's retrieve all of these right here. A retrieve, confirm. Um, let's put these away real quick. And let's actually make another one of these and then maybe we can go donate this one as well. Okay, so we need 10 of these uh, ingots, 10 black ones. We need 10 black ones. We need these as well. And then we need the blades over at this work table right here. Uh, we just need to barely make them. 
because of these, because of the bloodstones. Okay, so let's put pop this in. There we are. There we are. There we go. Let's drop these bad boys off. And then we'll just put this one down, and then we'll go to the other place, and then we'll donate uh, our old uh, carpenter bench. Um, I guess we could... I don't know. I, 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 I feel like we should donate it. Uh, we'll see if we can donate it. Um, let's do this. Power. And then we need... Ten of these. Uh, let's refill all of these. Uh, I think I'm not sure if I did that already. <laughs> kind of looks like we did. Okay, there we are. And then we just gotta wait for the silver, steel, whatever it's called things. So let's go find um, Phyllis. What's this? Night in dusty clothes? What are these? Lava grilled fish and bullseye? What the hell? I have so many missions. What the heck? Okay, so let's go over here. Oh my god, there's just so much to do. Okay, let's just... uh, What's this? It's, it's over here? Oh, Can it's I help you. you? Hello. You seem distracted. What's up? Well, I'm trying to work on my next story, but I've got no motivation. It's a classic tale with a hero and a princess. I have the general outline, but it's lacking that special spark. I'm not sure what's missing. Make the Is hero a girl too. I can do to help? Just, just, Actually, just do it. That's, that's, that's a great Elsa. idea. Yes, you can help. Meet me in the woods anytime before 16 o'clock today and I'll explain more. 16 o'clock today where? 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 Uh, 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 dude, I hate timed ones that actually have to be done on the day. Oh, uh, I feel so pressured now. I feel like I have so many things to do. Oh my god. Okay, I can see a little head over here. Um, Oh. Thanks for coming here. Okay, when the story begins, our hero is just a simple laborer. Try collecting some wood and stone. It will help me really picture the hero in my head. There I go, got one. And collect some sticks. There you are. That was great. I'm seeing it already. Next, our hero meets the princess. I'll stand in for her. Quick, say something heroic. <laughs> that was good. Next, the town is attacked by monsters. The oh! hero goes out alone and fights them off in the I'm name sorry. of the princess. Meet me in the field. Dude, that hee hee was so fucking cute. I am so sorry, but whoever your voice actor is, that was 10 out of 10. That was the cutest fucking thing I've heard. Absolutely in this game. The hee hee. Oh my god, that was so cute. Let's click on this. Uh where is this? Right here. There you are. Alright, this is the big climax. Our hero goes out fearlessly and fights against impossible odds. I want to see you take down a few monsters. Get out there and do it, hero. Think of the princess. Think of the princess. I can't believe I'm gonna fuck up these pan bats. Fucking piece of shit. You've hurt my princess. The princess, the princess, she's in danger. I must kill all these helpless panda flying bats. Die, but the print the name of the princess in the name of the princess. Wow, that was so exciting. My hands oh, we're, a little, we're a little too close. My mind is brimming with ideas. But first, it's time for the final scene. The hero returns from battle victorious and gives the princess a flower. It has to be a bellflower. That's the flower of true love. I'm not sure if there are any near here, so let's use a wildflower as a stand-in. Uh, 
Ah, so dreamy. This is perfect. You know, you make a pretty good hero yourself. Thank you so much for your help. Now I have to get home and start writing it down before I forget it all. Who knows? I might even call the hero... After me? Dude, that... Okay, I'm so sorry. I will never forget her her little laugh. Oh my god, I could just hear it over and over and over and over in my head. <laughs> But yes, okay, so uh, hopefully we have time to do the other ones. Um, let's head over here. And let's talk to Phyllis. And then hopefully we can drive to the other ones as well before it's too late. Hey. Bless. Thank you. There we go. Okay, and then let's go to um let's go to the other area that uh, we have to drive there because it's too far and I do not care to actually hello. the heck hopefully we have enough time to do these as well okay let's see uh, they're both here. Actually, let's clean this up real quick. So you want the grilled eel? Oh, I was looking for you. I heard you've just finished lift on the Western Plateau. Good on you. Yeah, need anything? Uh, what's a guy uh, can't congratulate someone on a job well done? Here, uh, he's got to want something in return, huh? I just wanted to tell you uh, about the Western Plateau. I think you'd be very... Uh, Beneficial for the both of us. Have you heard of Lava Rock? You mean Igneous Rock? Yeah, whatever a bookworm points is. If you get me the Lava Rocks, I can make a special dish I call a Cincy de Lava Evil. Uh, where in the street is you, um, you mix a couple of Lava Rocks with your charcoal and you can actually see the moisture from the inside the fish uh, begin baking. The fish ends up tender and yet uh, delightfully chewy. There's nothing, uh, there is nothing else like it, and I don't plan uh, to stop with fish. No, no, I can start cooking all kinds of things with uh, igneous rock. Interesting. So what do you say? Can you hook a hula brother up with a few uh, rocks? Sure. Run right on. I uh, already hear the fish sizzling. You're right. okay. Cool. And then yeah, what's up? Uh, kids these days. Oh, is something the matter? Kids can be so cruel. Some migrant birds came to our farm, old friend of mine, as a matter of fact. They've been roosting peacefully for a few days until yesterday. A couple of kids thought it would be funny to shoot them with a slingshot. Lucky none of them were killed, but I have a hands full of nurturing the ones that were hit back to health. What the fuck? I've scolded the kids, but I'm afraid they have no reason to listen to me. Uh, do you think you can go through them? Maybe build them something uh, to shoot at so they can leave my birds alone? Yeah, what the fuck? I have, bruh. I've never made something like this before. I'll try my best. The game has a dark game. Maybe you could uh, build something similar. All right, I'll see if Django knows anything. Dude, what the fuck? Bruh, these kids need to get beaten down. Bruh. 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 Bruh, 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 bruh. Like, I didn't think these kids in this area would be like that. I don't know. It, it just reminds. I don't know. Like I don't know. I don't understand why kids might gain like some weird freakish pleasure from doing weird, creepy things like that. Um, let's just head over here real quick. Where did she go? Aha! Here you are. 
Oh, the dark game? <laughs> yeah, I was inspired by one of my flea markets at the Walnut Grove. Do you find anything there? The statues of cool knights and stuff, little nutcrackers that would dance in the palm of your hand. The ears smell the cotton candy and the towels were so fluffy. Uh, that's great and all, but I just want to know if I can make one myself. Hmm. Seems like, seems like a uh, complicated contraption, eh? Uh, this may come as a bit of a surprise to you, but it's a particular dark game was constructed entirely by none other than yours truly. In fact, I suppose I can make something like that for you. It, it wouldn't be free, right? <laughs> Do you take me for some uh, go-hungry swine? A knight has no need for mindless accumulation of currency. However, according to our code, one should not expect nothing without an offer in return. Uh, either make me a shell necklace for my friend and maybe I'll make you a dark game. Okay, I think I can handle that. Bruh. Bruh. I guess I could pick up... It's not too bad. I, it just means I have to walk around a lot. But what's good about this is that I can actually come over here, uh, make the stuff, and actually grab some rocks. Ten! Oh my god, this man needs so much shit. Let's see. Um, craft. Let's see. Oops. Oh, there goes the necklace. Um... Okay, got the items. So the ten rocks, the one, sh the one necklace, and then the the beacon is being currently made as we speak. So let's go over here and talk to Django one more time. I don't know why I called him Diego earlier. I just remembered his name was something of that sort of that sort of ringtone. Here you are. Can I talk to you from over here instead? Nope. Perfect, this is what he likes. All right, as promised, a target and darts. Looks perfect, thanks. Um, apply to him with the, the oh, okay, cool. Bruh. I don't know why, but uh, uh, I'm not sure how, if, he, if his name is um, Adit or Audit or Adit. Uh, but yeah, interesting. Uh, yeah, his missions always seem like the ones that you have to walk back and forth and back and forth. Like, I did one of his missions before where I had to make a bunch of baskets and buckets and stuff like that and containers, and they just I had to go back and forth for them uh, all the time. So, let's see. Here we go. Oh, yeah, this is it. This is what I've been dreaming of. I'll round up my, all my brothers and grab a bunch of fish for everybody. Nice. Oh, shit. Wow. Nice, and then this is exactly what I'm hoping for. This will keep those kids occupied. Thanks for making this happen. No problem. What? Ooh, what's the coral? Wow, that is so pretty. Oh, that is so cool. That's very nice of him to actually give that. And that's, that's actually nice. Okay, so we got all of these missions done today. Uh, so let's hopefully. Oh my god, it's so nice. Okay, so, uh, settling down is still one of them. It's gonna be a long ways before I get that one done. Uh, it's literally gonna be the last two days of the month that I will be get that those done. Uh, but yeah, so let's go back home, see if we can make up more of the concrete. Uh, hopefully we have enough now to actually make I think twenty concrete. I think I saw two uh lists for the concrete. Um, and I think we'll see if we can get the other ones done today. Hopefully. I'm not sure if it closes, uh, at 20. I feel like it probably does. Let's actually do that right now. Um, let's see. Not quite. Uh, let's go up here. This one's done. And then we can actually make iron again. Okay.
Okay, it's gonna be a hot minute before any of these get done. But yeah. Okay, so let's actually go to our meals. I'm gonna take this cow out. And I guess we'll take this out as well. And then we'll put it in our other uh, box that don't quite know what to do with. Let's go down here. I have a box over here that is a, a, a little bit of nothing. Oh, we actually started putting stuff in here. Great. Just put the cow in here for now. And let's actually go inside and actually put this down. <laughs> so I never gone on a play date with uh, Django before. Uh, but today will be interesting. So, I've never been on a play date with Django before, and I've never actually gone to have a play date on Ember Island. And I feel like if someone's having a play date, they don't, like, if it rains, they cancel it. If it's, especially if it's outside. Oh, it's right here. Hi. There you are. Uh, let's start playing. I us hang around the city. I haven't done that in a while. Okay, let's actually try and hang out over here. Um, let's actually try and do the the haunted house because I've actually never done it. I was supposed to do it with an episode, but I never did. Do we talk to you about it? Shall we explore the haunted cave? Bruh, dude, that's expensive. Yes. Purchase it for two tickets uh, to explore the haunted cave. Yes. Dude, I've never done this before. Oh, what the heck? Okay. While exploring the haunted cave, you try to avoid the various traps and complete the cave in the shortest time to, uh, to test your courage. Show how long it take it took to clear the cave. A record number of traps you've avoided. You can pick up the scarce sticker at the entrance. It will turn... Okay. Um, you, it, you hit a trap, something coming. Be sure to dodge. Okay. So, you hit a trap. Something coming. Be sure to dodge. Uh, heads up. There's an object falling ahead. Don't get hit. Uh, when your catcher by goes, tap the interact button uh, continuously to escape. So it's E to escape. There are artificial ghosts wandering around the cave. If you hit them with the super scare scorker, you'll get a ghost badge. Ooh. This is kind of cool. Okay. Oh. How do you... Ooh. Oh, God. How are you supposed to, uh... Are you supposed to hit these? Dude, this is kind of meh. Oh, shit. I don't know how to... Oh! 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 Oh, I see! Django, you're not having fun, are you? <laughs> no! What the heck? Interesting. I've never done this before. Okay. This is kind of interesting. I don't... Ooh, ooh, almost got hit there. Almost got hit there. Almost got hit there. Oh, shit. Dude, this place is huge. What the heck? Ah, they're getting, they're getting gang banged. What the heck, Django? 
Django! <laughs> Django! This is interesting and kind of not- Oh my god, that one almost beat the shit out of me! Get the hell out of here. Why is it hitting me? What the heck? I'm bad at this. Django doesn't look like he's having fun. Oh, I got hit. Oh, I got stuck. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. What the heck is this? <laughs> Dodge. Django, you almost fucked me up. I almost fucking... Bruh. Oh, you can shoot them from long range. Interesting. Oh, this is so much easier when you can do it long range. Okay. I remember exploring these uh, after. Dude. Is this the end of the cave? Dude, this is- ah! Ah! Oh, it's not- it's no one. What the heck? Is that it? That wasn't- mm. Oh, so he did have fun. Okay. I was worried he wasn't have any he wasn't having any fun at all. Dude, I got so many ghost ones. Okay, cool. So let's head over here. Actually, I don't know where is the hangout spots. Okay, so there's one over here. Can you not blow fireworks? So I saw that you could make fireworks, stuff like that. Is it right here? Wanna doodle in the sand here? Yeah, I'll doodle in the sand. Would you like to draw an apple? Okay, oh shit, another mini game. Uh, the image, uh, the, okay, the imagined image is already on the sand, trace it to doodle. When you trace the image, it will appear on the sand. So I have to run around, oh my god. Oh my god. What the heck? What the heck? There we are. Nice drawing. Um, where's the? I believe we should be able to do fireworks, no? Uh, sure, let's get one more go. Let's get a couple more goes. Oh, can I draw a fish? Oh, that's not fair. Oh my god. Why do you want complicated shit, Jago? Oh my god, I almost didn't do it. Dude, he liked that a lot. Let's see if we can get one more in. Can I give you something? Yes, it's gift. Oh, this Confirm. is something special, my friend. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. <laughs> that didn't affect anything now. Uh, I guess we'll do it on the sand. A couple more times. A sword. Alright, 
these are kind of cool. They're not my favorite ones. So I feel like these are, I don't know. I, I don't think the Ember Island uh, date thing is like the coolest thing ever. It's kind of meh. Very, very nice. Oh, he really liked that. I wanted to uh, blow up fireworks, but I guess since it's raining, I cannot do that today. But I guess we'll just, uh, I don't want to have to run somewhere else. Oh, I see the mayors tell us that society is gaining momentum. What? I don't fucking know what he just said. The mayors tell us that society is gaining momentum. Bruh, the way he said it though. Can we not draw any more pictures? Did he get bored of that? I guess we could. Uh, how much time do we have for our date? Until six. Hello. Okay. I guess we'll put another date then. Uh, it, it's such a pity you're leaving so soon. It was fun. Thank you. Okay. Oh, well, it said it was going to end at six. So I was like, okay. Well, I think we did pretty good. Um, I really do not like the Ember Island one because it looked like if it's raining, you can't do the fireworks. Uh, the haunted cave, it was pretty quick. Uh, and then the drawing one, it looks like you can only draw three drawings at a time. Uh, and then that's pretty much it. You can only do the three and then that's it. So I feel like it was kind of almost like, it, it felt almost like a waste. Um, but it is what it is. Uh, at least we did, uh, at least we got it done with and all that stuff. But honestly, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you guys did, uh, please hit the like button down below. All likes and comments are always much appreciated. Hopefully the next episode we'll do a mass, like, oh, we're, we're pretty much done with all the commissions because we have them all kind of set up. Uh, I did kind of fuck up by collecting up the waterproof, uh, cloth. And I didn't have it already made, uh, cause I, I wanted to try and do it all at once. Uh, but it's fine. Uh, it gives time for the other things to be made and all that whatnot. Uh, but I have to find Arlo, give him his thing, and that's pretty much it. What I need to get done for today. So yes, I will see you guys uh, in the next episode, honestly. So yeah, uh, see you guys next time. Peace out, homies.